Hey guys, it's me, your best friend Joe. Welcome back to Mystery Monday here on the Half Moon Joe LLC channel. We're doing another Nancy Drew game, The Phantom of Venice. That's right, we got our vaccine and we're headed to Venice. Now, I did play this game for about four minutes just to adjust the sound levels as usual, but hopefully they are still okay. And... Oh shoot, the ball burned out. Nancy's at it again, sis. She's broken the bulb. I don't know anything about the case file, though. I actually know nothing because I didn't even look at it. So let's see Thanks what we're getting Prudence into. Rutherford, the wealthy socialite whose necklace Prudence I helped Rutherford? recover while solving that scarlet hand case a while back. I'm on my How way do you to do that one? Italy. Apparently, someone there has been dressing up in a mask and cape and stealing valuable gay. pieces of art. The news Be gay, do crime. The Phantom, not only because of the way he dresses, but because he leaves behind so few clues. Prudence, who loves Venice and belongs to an organization dedicated to preserving the city's art, is art. outraged the thief hasn't been caught yet. So she talked someone she knows at the GDIF, the Italian version of our FBI, into having me help the police in their investigation. She arranged for me to stay in Venice in the palazzo she used to own. Oh my god, this is the plot of the Lizzie McGuire movie. Named Margarita Foberg. Beyond that, all I know for sure is that I'll be working undercover. And as soon as I arrive, the police will send me something that will lead me to my assignment. Undercover? What will be? I have no idea. But am I excited? Oh, see. Si. See. Si. Let me tell you, as Isabella Parigi once said, we, we, freaky. This is getting we, we, freaky. In the hit movie, the Liz McGuire movie, Isabella, Isabella Parigi once said, this is getting we, we, freaky. <laughs> um, if anybody has a better Italian accent than Hilary Duff, you're wrong if you think that, by the way. Just by the way. Uh, so I'm going to pick up my Italian dictionary. Ciao! And I am heading off on my junior high... Where? Did, when did Lizzie McGuire go? She went to Rome on her junior high... Was it her middle school graduation or a junior high graduation? Regardless! I'm going to kiss Gordo. At the end of this... I'm gonna kiss Gordo. Uh oh, what's happening? Uh oh. If you think you have a better accent than Hilary Duff playing Isabella Parigi in the hit movie, the Liz McGuire movie, you're wrong. Did I? Am I already smirking in the poo? This is a flashback. Open the door! Is that poo water? Oh no! On well, my shoes? Things are not looking good. What the heck happened? This case started out so well. I mean, what could be better than waking Record up scratch. in Venice, Italy? <laughs> Bet you're wondering how I got here, smirking in the poo. Wicka wicka! Rec that's a record scratch sound. Oh my god, this is just like the hotel room in the Lizzie McGuire movie. Who's this picture of this random person? Well, so I can't turn yet. That's my roommate stuff. Mine's on the other side of the room. I mean, even better, I would love to snoop. Is this your roommate? Oh my gosh. Your roommate is Sarah Paulson? Oh! This is the whole game. This is me the whole game, by the way. I want to go to Venice ASAP. Look at that. There's a Tomb Raider level here. Okay. We love to see it. Um, We've got art. We've got history. We've got snooping. An interactive guide to... Are books usually interactive? Aren't all books interactive? Oh, Venice was built major... <gasps> Oh my gosh, this is going to be just like when Liz McGuire goes to that gelato shop and gets mistaken by the Italian paparazzi as Isabella Parigi from the hit movie, The Liz McGuire Movie. <gasps> Am I going to have to scoop gelato in this one? I'm already the most excited I've ever been for an Nancy Drew game. Like the ice cream, which most of is made from whole cow's milk and sugar. Sis, the best is made daily. I'm learning. Today we're learning. The Wheel of Cheese! The book you... This is one of those books you can click. Also known as a Kindle. Am I gonna... Oh my god. I can just flip through it myself. Major Science. 
Oh, oh, oh. Josh's palace? Dogecoin? I'm going through it. Did Nancy Drew predict Dogecoin? <laughs> I'm going through it. I'm going through it today. Is this happening? Carnival. Carnival or Carnival. Carnival. Also spelled Carnival or Carnival. A winter celebration. Oh, interesting. I usually associate that with Carnival in Brazil. With the word. With uh, Carnival in Brazil. An oval mask? Oh, I'm doing my Duolingo. I'm going to... Oh, I'm going to be mispronouncing all these things, and I apologize so much in advance. Fontana, Statua, Banco, Porta, Blue. I got it. Oh. I know dog. Oh my god, prepositions. Okay, I actually just wanted to snoop in the drawer. I can't even snoop in the drawer. Oh, my wardrobe. Let's see, what should I wear? Do I get to pick out an outfit? What? Oh my gosh, this looks like just like what Liz McGuire would wear. She would probably not wear the scarf. But she would wear this belt that we got a wet. Oh, I can only do the scarf or the belt. Well, we're going to do the belt that I got a wet seal. The belt that I got a wet seal. We're going to put on... Do I get to collect more clothing? Do I get to actually buy more clothing in this one? Um, I am going to wear these sunglasses. And the matching hat. Oh, obscured. Nobody can see me. Um, I do like the pink. I really like the pink, actually. Oh, as far as these, I'm going to go with the jeans. The jeans are good, probably going to be more comfortable. This looks like something Lizzie would wear so far. And ballet flats. Ballet flats for sure. This is so Hillary Duff. 2006. Is it not? We still don't know what Nancy looks like. It's just the cardboard cutout. Um, oh, I get to go in my makeup bag? How has she scrubbed the toilet with this toothbrush? You need to get a new toothbrush. And you should put a, should have, should have put a cap on it. This is actually the acrylic paint that she uses on her face when she goes undercover. Why does she have acrylic paint in here? And some bobby pins. We got some... Oh my gosh, she uses the Maybelline um, uh, Fit Me concealer just like I do. Super toothpaste for her and her super smile. I can't take anything. Why does she literally have acrylic paints in here? I guess this is meant to be a mirror, but... We're not seeing nothing. So I'm waiting for the Nancy Drew vampire spinoff. I don't feel like going to bed yet. Oh, that makes one of us, Nancy. That makes one of us. So I can't look at my nightstand. <gasps> can I jump off the balcony? <gasps> oh! I can look down in different drawers. This is where Paolo is going to stand. When I, Lizzie McGuire, from the hit movie, the Lizzie McGuire movie, am skipping the, the school tour because I am pretending I'm an Italian pop star sensation and going out with Paolo. <laughs> this is, if y'all need to watch the Lizzie McGuire movie. Required reading, required watching. Not fucking this. I just downed the whole fucking box of chocolates. And y'all can't even tell me I went... Was I not supposed to do that? I'm done. I finished the game. I went to Fran I went to Italy. I ate chocolates. Am I not supposed to eat all the chocolates? <laughs> the sweet turds. Hello. You must be the American Margarita mentioned. I'm Colin Baxter. I'm Nancy Drew. If you're looking for Margarita, Justin she's up Timberlake's on the Timberlake's in this? The rooftop garden. Um, what are you doing? What are you doing, if you don't mind my asking? Right now, Solved I'm showing this it. 14th century mosaic, which means, without getting overly technical, I'm cleaning the tesserae that remain in place, repairing those that oh, have been damaged, tesserae, and the little those individual that are pieces. new ones custom crafted to match. How does she not know what tesserae means? Can we not use the context clues? We know what a mosaic is, Nancy. Is Margarita paying you to do this? She is indeed. 
As little as possible, of course. Yes, Justin but Timberlake. just between you and me, I do this for free. I became fascinated with art in general, uh -uh. and mosaics in particular, when I was at Oxford. Oxford University. That's where I'm from, actually. Oxford, England. What? At least that's where I was born. Oxford. I live here Have you heard of Oxford? Because I'm from Oxford. I went to the university. I was I born that, there, lived there, no Oxford. Guilt. Why do you feel guilty? People like me and Helena are the reason true Venetians are slowly going extinct. We foreigners come to Venice, fall in love with her, and wind up staying. High demand for food and housing results in high prices, which in many cases means the people who were born here have to leave because they can no longer afford to live here. Mm -hmm. If I could be granted one wish, it would be to have been born here. That way, I would feel entitled to live here, and I would know how to speak Italian. You don't speak Italian? Look at this Tiffany Much as wall lamp. Me to admit it, no. Languages don't come easily to me. And since I am able to do what I do without knowing Italian, you know, I have some slides of various tesserae. Not only are they enormously informative, but they're also quite beautiful. Would you like to see them? Is he asking me on a date? Sure. On my first Marvelous. day in Italy? Here we go. This one could have been plucked off a lemon tree. It's so wild because people who went to a school like, like Oxford Indigo, almost never mention it. You. Outstanding color. I bet he went to AP Mosaic. He was in AP Mosaic's class. I adore <laughs> this shade of crimson. Oh, Gorgeous. never mind. He's gay. Like it was carved from a sunset. It's blood Sometimes orange. Is simply breathtaking. What a beauty. That's just gray, sis. It's like it was painted by the sun. Lovely shade of scarlet. Have you ever seen such a radiant shade of orange? It's blood I orange. Adore the shade of crimson. Oh, wait, is he just saying that? Oh my god, he just started going on a loop saying the exact same thing. Sis. Wow. Wow. Almost <laughs> looks like an emerald, doesn't it? Wow. Period. I guess that looks like an Look emerald if you've never seen it. an emerald. Are we still doing this? I'd oh. love to see more, but I really don't have time. Wow. I thought I had a I long adore lost this little grand Someone who shared my passion for beauty, for art, but you apparently are like everyone else, interested only in what something is worth instead of what it offers the soul. No, no, please. I'd stay, but I really do need to be somewhere. Believe me, I think what you're doing is fascinating, and you obviously really know your stuff. In fact, that figurine in front of you, I've been dying to ask you about it. It's exquisite. What, this statuette? Yes, it is exquisite. It's an example of late Etruscan bronze work, no doubt cast some 2,200 years ago. I'm not sure how Margarita <laughs> came to own it, but she's very fortunate. <laughs> the worst. It's almost impossible to find Bronzetti of this quality this. outside a museum. You see, after they conquered the Etruscans, the ancient Romans melted down thousands Do I need to be taking notes? of statues like this just so they could make coins. Is there a quiz later? Shoot, I wish I had time to hear more. No, 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 you go on. We can talk more later. Oh, a parcel was just delivered for you. It's by the door. Thank you. This music is very intense. Do I need to turn down the music? It seems loud in my ear. A parcel? Oh, that must... Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, that must be my, uh, my bestie bag. I have a bestie bag shipped to Italy. <laughs> it's totally the guy who locks you in the poop cell later. This reminds me of I dated a guy once who collected ants. And he was trying to tell me about his ant collection, which I thought... When you say, hey, come up and see my ant collection. I don't think that's what's going to happen. Nope. I actually had to listen... To his ant collection. Is this German? I gotta learn this. Ants. An ant collection. Um, it was interesting. On, on these little ants in these vials. And he had like gone to the rainforest or something to look at ants. I was like, this is actually pretty cool. I don't personally have any hobbies. But if I did, I'd consider ant collecting. If I weren't really into planking right now, I might consider ant collecting. Okay, so this is someone's notes in German, right? Which I've been trying to learn again. So maybe by the end of this Let's Play series, we'll figure out exactly one clue. Now, where's the door that my that my bestie bag, that my iPad pillow 
This looks like a door. Oh, no, this goes to my room, doesn't it? Oh, no. Nancy, you are up. Come talk to me. Buongiorno. And again, welcome to Carnas Costa. I see you finally decided to get up. Uh, I've been, Actually, I've been up for a while. Good for you. I got up, showered, and came straight up here. If it's a daytime and it's sunny, no matter the time of year, this is where you will find me. They say the sun gives you wrinkles and worse. And that may be too, Exclamation point moisturizer is a link to my moisturizer on Amazon. So makes you tan. <laughs> to me, to be tan is good. S it has SPF in it. Daily moisturizer with SPF. Do you like it? Hey. There you go. Exclamation point moisturizer in the chat. Amazon link to my moisture, my daily moisturizer, which I would recommend to her. Oh my God. Should I tell her the room is smaller than I thought it would be? I do have a roommate. We'll be nice. Oh yes. The room is wonderful. <laughs> you do not mind having a roommate? Um, I do actually. Well, sort of. I said but never again after snore. college, sis. I warned Prudence that you would have to share a room, but she said you had to come to Venezia this week and you had to stay here. And as we both know, what Prudence wants, Prudence gets. Have you gone outside the car yet? I don't know what that word no, means. No, not yet. Just do not forget to take your key and lock the and front lock door, the door whenever you leave. This is not the Palazzo Grassi, but I do have uh, several valuable pieces of art. And with Il Fantasma, this phantom thief the phantom. running around and stealing everything, I prefer not to take any chances. Um, I met the guy who's restoring. He's pretty intense. I met the guy who's restoring the big mosaic in the main room. He is SPF is literally intense. so important. A daily moisturizer without uh, fragments with SPF. Any man can find Get it. Is looking at pieces of painted rock all day. Talking to him, it's like taking a sleeping pill. Que barba. But they say he is good. And so he works for me. How much do, How you, much know do you know about, about this flop? Not much, this Justin Timberlake impersonator. Lydia von Helstein raved about the work he did for her. And what is good enough for the Countess of Schlosselbeck is more than good enough for me. Schlosselbeck? Um... How long have you lived here? Almost two years. Two wonderful but very expensive years. The city expects homeowners like me to maintain these old buildings. But who pays for everything? We do. The Restoration Council gives oh, us nothing. Oh, her and her poor house that she owns in a big you city. It? You miss the point. <laughs> Just because I can afford to pay does not mean I should. It is not the, rich people uh, holding on to all their principle. fucking pennies. It is the principle of the thing. <sighs> Besides, being rich is something I like. If I am all the time spending money, I will soon be unrich. Okay, Jeff. Je oh, all right, Jeff. All right, Elon. Up here, suntanning on this roof. I'll let I'll you get, let get back, you to, get your back sunbathing. to your sunbathing. Ciao. Uh, me, uh, I'm gonna plug in my fan. Y'all just watch her sun sunbathe. I'm gonna plug in this fan. Whew. Watching her suntanning is making me hot. I was about to say the accent's good. Is the accent not good? Chat with the affiliate links. Exclamation point bestie bag in the chat. So we did see this. Why are you touching my things? <laughs> Please stop. At least she's wearing, I guess that's lip balm. Hopefully it's a lip balm with SPF, but I know it's probably not. There's Argon. Oh, gross. Why are there so many bugs? We all want to be rich so we can buy stuff while rich people just don't want to spend any money. That's kind of the vibe I'm getting. Oh my god, not him fully watching me trying to break out of here. Excuse me, I'm assuming this is the way. Oh! Let's go oh. get my, my bestie oh, back. Shoot, oh! I'm sorry. Here, here Paulson, I am so sorry. I've never seen American Horror Story, but I hear that you're good in it. Hildegard Killian. You must be my newly arrived roommate. Okay. I'm Helena Berg. Is she I'm the Nancy one Drew. who's from Sorry who's for all German? The when I came in last night. 
My plane got in three Doesn't hours she late. look like Sarah Paulson? I don't need to worry about waking me up. I can sleep through almost anything. But I'm sure you have things to do and places to go, so I won't keep you. Oh, by the way, there's a parcel for you in the entryway. Ciao. Is that... Was that a German accent? German. I'm sorry. I don't know. I thought all the accents were spot on, no? <laughs> By the way. Uh-oh. German-ish is what we're calling it. Has the phantom struck again? Nuns at the convent! So nice of them, by the way, to write the Italian newspaper in English. Police report that sometime at midnight and 5 a.m. So that's probably something we need to remember. Head mother. Oh! Is this Sister Act meets Lizzie McGuire movie? Swiftly and silently. They, oh, let me tell you, the journalist who wrote this. Striking swiftly and silently. They loved writing that. The chalice is, chalice is solid gold. That's like really bendy though, isn't it? Solid gold is like not very good. Miss Nancy Drew, please find your enclosed bank. You will find a convenient automatic teller machine in the Piazza San Marco. Please visit there immediately so we can activate your... <gasps> I've got my gold card. I'm on the train to Milan. And it's fashion week. This. I'm out of here. Me storming out of the villa. Um... <laughs> I need to say thank you to some... <gasps> Wait, what? Is this where I... Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. San... Oh, how do I get there? Oh, my God. Do I have to navigate? I need to get to the Piazza San Marco, but I can't just click it. It looks like I can... I have to jump from stop to stop. I have to actually guide myself through the metro? This. We made it. <laughs> uh, Nancy dress is pretty poppin' though. We saw her outfit she was just wearing. Um, Missouri! Oh no, not Venice is sinking. Thank you so much for the bits. Uh, Mill Globbins! First time sub, I appreciate that so much. Good to see you. Thank you so much. Keep those skis 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 going in the chat. If I ever need any reference books. This is Hayden Panettiere. This is literally Hayden Panettiere. Is that not Hayden Panettiere? This is a stock photo of Hayden Panettiere on a teen magazine. Kit Kat Moss, thank you so much for the bitch. <laughs> yes, thank you. Kenny Noir, thank you for the bits. Not bog yogurt. Thank you so much. G Pavarotti, thank you so much for the 50 bits. I appreciate that so much. Keep those skis 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 going in the chat. That is her literal face, is it not? That is Hayden Panettiere. Yeah, where's my J14? So the person who runs the kiosk is... Oh. <gasps> is that a book on astrology? I need to activate my card first, I think is what we're supposed to... Here's the bank. I recognize... <gasps> Is this a turd machine? A handful of shredded turd. Is this bird seed? Oh, it is bird seed. Okay. I need a card. Nancy, you have a card. Welcome, Nancy Drew. All information is confidential. Crime dossier? Not the ATM. Not the ATM giving me a fucking crime dossier. Um, Miss Ari, thank you so much. Outfit customizer, yes! Thank you so much for the bits. Kit Kat Moss fashion, I appreciate that. Oh. Sam's room was dirty way for ant collecting. Thank you so much for the bits. And Emma, thank you so much for the gift sub. I appreciate that so much. Keep those skiz, skiz, skiz going in the chat. You are, of course, what dreams are made of. 
Summary of crimes attributed... Okay, disabling the alarm system. The Macchiano ring? The Leipzig Gutenberg Bible? Isn't that a real thing? Other than you just do party with black cape and a mask. Dogecoin sword. Alarm system. Um, can I just have money to flee to flee to Milan? After you read this, you will be provided with a pair of binoculars and a. This fucking ATM's gonna spit out a pair of motherfucking binoculars. These ATMs in Italy are wild! After you read this, you'll be provided with a pair of binoculars, a PDA, a PDF. The surveillance team interest will page you via the PDA when I get a beeper. <gasps> Background. Wait, so why am I working with the Italian FBI? Ward in Genoa, kicked out of Polytechnico, Tesla, Dogecoin, for cheating in December, installs wiretap surveillance of his business partner revealed nothing out of the ordinary, but they're wiretapping him. He buys an assortment of chocolates! I just ate a whole fucking box. He rarely eats out. Not worth it, then. Uh, random, unaccompanied walks. He has no criminal record. Not actually this. Not this. It has everything except actual money. Can I throw the bird seed on the ground? Nope. This is not what I intend. Nope. Stop holding the bird seed, please, Nancy. <laughs> put, put the bird seed down. Thank you. So. There's that. There's that. I mean, are these the only three place, two places I can go right here? I can buy. Let's look at my journal. That's what I should be doing. Can't check that off yet. Oh, give Prudence Rutherford. That, Take a good look around the check. room. Still have to do that. Talk more to some Hel check. To Helena Berg. Check. Read the Can't ATM. Check that off yet. Oh! Nancy Drew, we have a grammar issue. ATM machine. ATM already stands for automatic teller machine. So that's like saying automatic teller machine machine. Wait for the police Can't to page check me. Can't that off yet. Sad if true. You tell them, yeah. <laughs> Sad if true. An undercover bank? Yeah, Kit Kat Moss! Thank you for the bit, Caddy Noir. Throw the bird seat on the tanning lady. Not this. Thank you so much. Keep those goose 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 going in the chat. Seems like I can only buy... Sassy Detect... How... I'll probably need this. Why is there a magazine called Sassy Detective? German English Dictionary, that's probably good. I want this fucking candy. And I want the Hayden Panettiere magazine. I was a fan. Alright. I guess I'll, um... Oh, I need to use the phone. Well, let's... Slowly go back to somewhere else now. Wherever... It is I'm going. Compo? Go freery? Why does it just show like different shoes down there in the corner? With all the birds sing lying around, I wouldn't be surprised when a pesky squirrel shows up. That's true, Jared Michael. Thank you so much for the bits. And G Pavarotti, thank you so much for the bits too. I appreciate that so much. The Argon Building. Let's just check our messages. Ciao, this is Nancy Do. Oh. Yes, is this Detective Leporace? Si, but please, to you I am just Sophia. I'll remember that, Sophia. Sophia. Why do you call? Can I be watching Fungo? He's not in his office. I know, I just wanted to make sure this PDA thing works. It is from the GDAF. 
Military equipment is good. But you are smart to test it, Nancy. And you are good to help us. We are very short-handed. Carnevale keeps the police very busy. Carnevale. I just hope I can help. Remember, when you have seen Fongo do something of interest, call me. Ciao. I've got to follow that guy? So this is like one of those cell phones you give to your eight-year-old where it only calls one person, right? I wonder if I can put a tracking device on someone. That would be fun. Looks like I'm going to have to pick this lock somehow. Bobby pins. It better be fucking bobby pins. I know exactly what I'm doing. Bobby pins? Is that gonna be hair pins? You can't even get that fucking past me, sis. You can't even get that fucking past me. I'm in, I'm in, I'm in, I'm in Nancy's head. What's that sound? Ta not Taffy! <laughs> Getting to war! Not here today, gondola tomorrow. <gasps> That's my pager. Antonio Fongo is in his office. Time to go to work. Thank you so much for the bits. I appreciate that. Keep those skus 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 going in the chat. I'm going to get some pin some hairpins. Remember how I didn't lock the door? Where's my oh! Where is my room? Did I go in this room? Oh, that's the locked one. My room is over there. Excuse me. Excuse me. <laughs> I gotta say, I love the color scheme. In Stardew Valley... Oh. Oh, that's not this phone. Oh, shit! That's this phone. Hello? Hello? There's too Is many phones. Nancy? Stardew Valley, I'm it's doing like a red bird. thing yes, with my it's house. Nancy. How are you? But to be honest, I'm rather peeved. Were you or were you not to call me just as soon as you were settled in there at the call? Why is this me I'm doing sorry, this voice? I called, but I've been very busy. And I've been very worried. worried. I was I afraid say, Margarita had allowed my beloved kindness ghost to fall into such a state of disrepair that it was no longer acceptable. Oh, no, no. The Why is this my voice? Brassica? Yes, it sure has. Good. The sooner it's you get to work, get to work the better. Literally, Mrs. Video, Doubtfire. Both the GDIF and the local gendarmerie are expecting great things from you. As am I. No one wants this phantom scoundrel. Her voice is like peeking. I'm flattered, Miss Rutherford. <laughs> I'll do my it best. It sounds like Mickey. Like Mickey Mouse. Or anything. Like I told you, I just like solving mysteries. Just see that you solve this one in a timely fashion, dear. We leave on a cruise in two weeks, and I we must solve it on the rich people's schedule. Flop. Stolen works of art have been recovered. Margarita's not real happy. I get the feeling Margarita's not real happy. She's about the one tanning. She's the one tanning. That is just tough, tiddlywinks. Putting you up is the least she can do for me after all I've done for her. Just what have you done for her? I made the mistake of helping her pay for some of the repairs that reared their ugly little heads after I sold her the car. Wait, I, I thought she was not rich. Because of any legal obligation, but because of my abiding affection for the place and all things Venetian. She is such oh. a cheapskate. I feared she would ignore what had to be done until the car crumbled into ruins. How did she get to be such a cheapskate? When her husband died, he left Margarita everything, which amounted to a small fortune. A small yes, fortune. I love the things rich the people say. A small fortune. And now, after years of bad investments and wasteful spending, she's starting to feel the pinch. But I'm afraid it's my erstwhile residence there in Venezia that must pay the price for her fiscal ineptitude. I'll let you get back to whatever it is you're doing. <laughs> whatever you're doing. She just... I'm writing uh -oh. my memoirs. They shall be called The Principles of Prudence. Unfortunately, this has necessitated my hiring an assistant. You really must stop thinking bad thoughts about Ginger. Oh, yes, she's talking to someone else. The other day, poor Ginger mistook the shapeless lump of leather my assistant called her purse for a doggy toy and ripped it to shreds. Piggy would never. She's still a bit perturbed. Yes. Although, believe you me, Ginger did her a massive favor. Anyway, if you ever cannot reach me, it means
means we are hard at work. The bone chance. Bone chance. Um, how do you tell non... You can hear the voice actor running out of steam. Um, how do, what's 911 in Italy? Because you know we always try 911 in these games. Wait for it. So it's not 911. Okay, let's try something else. Well, what's the... What's the... Is it 5... It's 511 in Italy? Why are y'all tapping all these numbers? I need someone who knows for sure. We're not here to play second guessing. Oh, I don't care if it works or not. I just want to dial it. 112-411. Not 69-420. Next time I go to Venice, I'm leaving you clowns at home. I'm leaving you clowns with the babysitter. 113. Okay, we'll try next time we go to the phone. Uh, da Zip, thank you so much for the five months. I appreciate that so much. Keep those scoots, scoots, scoots going in the chat. You are, of course, what dreams are made of. I appreciate that. I just remembered. Now I can suddenly pick up the bobby pins. Do y'all call them bobby pins? Or do we just call them hair pins? Um, Hello, let's... Nancy, right? So, how do you like Venice? Let's not be too overwhelming. It's all right. It's all right. You'll think differently once you've been here a couple of days. I think Venice is the most fascinating city in the Sarah world. Sarah Paulson really it's loves history, Venice. It's art, it's layout. Everything about it is so rich and so beautiful and says so much about human ingenuity. I absolutely love it. Um, okay. Have you ever thought about living here? I have indeed. In fact, every time I come here, I make an effort to meet new people. Having friends is very important to me, you see? But I don't want to move here until Exclamation I can afford my own bag for besties. So, so, until that day, I shall have to content myself with staying here wherever I can and as often as I can. Looks like she's blinking twice for help. Uh, what, what do, you do you do for a living? I'm a journalist. Right now, I live in Hamburg because that's where the offices of your event magazine are. I do most of my writing for them. But I know far more about Venice than I do about Hamburg. In fact, oh, she's I know more Austrian? about Venice than most Venetians do. I know where the best souvenir stands are, the nicest glass shops. Yeah. I'll make you a list of the cheapest. Oh, cafes. that's nice. No, no, that's okay. No, you I do want do that. that. Nancy, you shush. You don't want to know where the cheapest cafes are. Are you sure you're American? <laughs> I'm just not into touristy things. That's all. I see. Wow. Oh, but you could tell me what your very oh, favorite spot in Venice you're a, is. You, I'd you're love an American. To know that. Why don't? Why aren't you cheap? Well, let me think. <laughs> this that one is true. Is true. Be Campo San Paolo. There's something. I don't know. Something very avant-garde about it that's quite charming. Um, what do you so think about what the, do you think this, about all this, this phantom, phantom stuff? stuff? I probably shouldn't say this, but I think it's great. A caped figure darting down walkways beside we love me. It. Canals, melting mist-like into the shadows, escaping not with stolen money, but stolen art. It's all just so wonderfully Venetian. Have you written about it? I'm working on a piece for your event. She yes. loves to stir shit up. I tried to tell up. them I was here on holiday, but when they agreed to pay half my expenses in addition to my noble fee, how could I refuse? Besides, as far as crime sprees go, this one is rather refreshing. Il Phantasma hasn't physically hurt anyone, and has some very interesting ideas when it comes to what's worth stealing. Interesting! In fact, it's altogether possible this phantom could turn out to be a woman. Woo! That would be a story. Is she I confessing? So, have you dug up anything juicy Did for she your just story confess? on this phantom thief person? This case is so huge, the police are swamped. Apparently, they've got people coming in from all over the world to help track down leads. My contacts at the police station are too busy to give me the time of day, let alone a juicy tip. However, one of my non-police sources just Let's told hear it, Sarah Paulson. He said the word on the street is that the next thing the thief steals <gasps> is going to be a person. He's going no. to kidnap someone? Probably a statue, a very right? someone. At least, 
Zatsuguma. Well, if only I knew some wealthy people who might get kidnapped. Why is everyone... Nancy's wealthy and everyone around her is wealthy. Do you talk to Colin Baxter very much? I try to talk to him, but he's so focused on his work. Having a decent conversation with him is virtually impossible. Just the Once, wealthy, out of sis. Politeness, I feigned an interest in what he was doing, and the next thing I knew, he was showing you his test race life. <laughs> yes! <laughs> they went on and on and on! It was nightmarish. I felt like a seabird that had landed in an oil slick and couldn't fly away. The only way I could escape was to confess that I found the slides less than fascinating. Which hurt his feelings terribly, I'm afraid. Wow, she doesn't be. really... She's not very tactful. We'll say that. Uh, yeah, same thing happened to me. So you don't know so much about it. That's about where him? we're getting. I know nothing about him at all. Actually, that's not quite true. Spill it! But while he was working, his cell phone rang. He immediately left the room to take the call, but as he was leaving, he picked up by saying, This is Justin. Not Colin. Justin. Justin Timberlake! I told you! Why is he Justin Timberlake? He's using a fake name? Either Justin or Colin. One of them's fake. I guess I'll get I going. I should get going. It's been a pleasure. Pretty look it. Thank you. My, my Justin? To me. In Venice? My, my husband you Justin? You have it all, don't you, Nancy Drew? What'd she say about my boyfriend? Oh. Ned? Ted? I don't even remember his fucking name. <laughs> oh, Ned? Ted? Who the fuck keep up with him? Hello, Nancy. Do you live here at the car? No, I have a room in a building on the other side of the Grand Canal. A very small room. Okay. I spend so much well, time I'll here lock the door so when you leave. There. I suppose technically I do live here. Okay, I got I should be go. running along. What's his name? What's whose name? The bloke who gave you that locket you're wearing. Oh, Ned. Goodbye, Nancy. Fucking creepy. Justin, Colin, whatever his name is. Fucking creepy. Yeah, he's gonna kill me. Okay, that's still the newspaper. Maybe I can pick up the newspaper daily or something. I should just need to tell him that you got the shittiest hobby, sis. Well, I shouldn't say that. Even if your hobby isn't very interesting, you should know that it's not interesting to other people. There's nothing wrong with having a hobby that other people don't find interesting, but forcing them into a conversation about it when they clearly aren't interested, that's where we have issue. You get to play as Ned? Why would I ever want to play as Ned? <gasps> Is this a casino? Oh. I need to translate this. Okay. Then translate it, Nancy. Dancers wanted! This is where it begins for me. This is where my Italian Here adventure for the dance begins. Audition, take a look at the dance instruction book. When you think you're ready, put the cat suit on and get on stage. The if cat you know, suit? You can keep the suit and come by anytime you want and dance some tips. Oh, and if you're not here for the edition, beat it. What is this voice? This like oh, I didn't six, mean to seven, <laughs> eight. Who made this game? Who made this game? Who did this? Uh uh. You go. Girl. This isn't real. This isn't fucking real, is this? This isn't real right now. Oh. I'm having a fever dream. <laughs> You're awful! You're awful! <laughs> Not this move! Not this move at the burlesque show! <laughs> I have to go. Can I get off the stage? I'm so embarrassed. There's no button to leave the stage. You're awful! Uh-uh! Wonderful! Uh, uh. Not this again. Why is the fucking Link Ocarina up here? Go, this girl. fucking Link's Ocarina. 
Oh my god, look. Boop, 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 boop. Doot, doot, doot. Wah, 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 wah. Get Not off the it. stage. Get off the stage. And don't even think about taking that costume with you. Uh. No, 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 no. When we say this aged perfectly, was this even good back then? Was that cutscene even appropriate back then? <laughs> was this minigame? <laughs> Why is this real? Oh, this is the best game I've ever played in my life. This is the best game I've ever played in my life. I didn't know it was going to start immediately. Uh, the fans expect certain dance move when certain sounds play. Please make sure you understand which cue goes with which dance move. Oh, got it. To a cue and a new one plays, switch to the dance for the newest clue. Tech will try and provide a colored light cue. That's good. Very accessible. If you're given the part, you can keep the cat costume dance costume for free. Not this. The monkey? Claps, Ocarina. This is very specific. Sea Kid? The fins. I really just need to know the colors, right? Those things were already different colors. Oh no. Am I really thinking of Sarah Paulson? Am I thinking of the right actor? Yeah, that's Sarah Paulson. All right, let's give it another go. Now, this is clearly the mask that the Phantom is wearing, is it not? Whoever this dance okay, instructor is. Let's see what you okay, got. sure. Was that a sound cue? I didn't see the light change. I oh. need to tighten it up. Those lights? Terrible! Bad. I think that was the wrong one. This is mine. I don't think so. Alright, just get me off this stage. I'm clearly- Ah! He likes that one. Drums. I oh, need to tighten it up. Not this. Okay. Give me another one quick. I know what I'm doing. I got this. I didn't even hear anything. Oh, you need to tighten it up. Why does he say I need to tighten it up? I'm clicking it like immediately. Go away. <laughs> I thought and I don't did even well. think about taking that costume with you. Sorry to this man, but I have other things to do. Wait, was there pigeons out here? Because I really wanted to feed the pigeon. Is that a pigeon or is that a dead rat? Oh, or is that just paper? I really want to feed pigeons. Uh, I think it's a dead rat. Ah, oh, I love Italy. Anyway. <laughs> he really hates me. Why do they all hate me? Why does everyone hate me? No, <laughs> yeah, we just go tell Ned we're uh, going on another case, but in reality, we're going dancing in Venice, and that's that's just fine. I'm sorry, this is actually Elder Scrolls Online. 
Am I supposed to make them all go down a certain way? I thought the point of a lockpick was to push it all the way in and then use the tumblers. Uh, I just need to know real quick from people who have played this game. I do have no back seating turned on. But, am I, are these all supposed to be down or all supposed to be up? I don't know what pattern these are supposed to be in. At least I got the bobby pin. Middle line. So, like, right here. They need to be right here. Oh, aligned with the seam. Is this the seam? Middle, the lines have to match. Line it up with the line. Now, I see like several lines. This is a line. This is a line. This is a line. Not breaking into Manette's office again. No, we, you can't just say yes. <laughs> you can, when, I, when I give you three line options, we can't just say yes. We have to tell me which line. Is it this line, this line, or this line? Yes. I'm just I'm just playing with y'all. Um, there is one that doesn't. Here we go. Is that not all the way up? Oh, line these up with the black line. You know the line, the dark line with the cutoff. Oh, okay, so. Like that is what we're meaning. All right, I got it. That's really not help. Hey, che diavolo fai qui? Did he kill me? Got you out of jail? That's fair. I just went to jail. Uh, I'll go again. Why don't you just fucking I can't knock? read this. I can't. Yeah, I think it says proprietor. Oh, owner. Oh my god, I can make it. What what are those numbers though? I need I need to translate Nancy, I need to, I'm trying to translate those numbers. I should save the game. Here is my test file. And we'll just save it as Phantom. <laughs> That's true, I didn't get blown up. You know what? I'd rather get blown up though. So I guess I need to Oh, here's a market. I haven't been over here yet. I can suddenly go here. Um Was that the music from the last game? Kick at Moss? Thank you so much for the bits. I appreciate that. I don't remember this part of the Lizzie McGuire movie. That was the part where she dances at the Coliseum. The dancing. Yes, just like the Lizzie McGuire movie. Thank you so much, Rev Dot. And Kit Kat Moss. Don't break in there while he's there. Yeah, I got, I got the hint. I got the hint. <laughs> Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Keep those skis, skis, skis going in the chat. I don't really understand what the track thing is. More birdseed? I thought this was going to be a clothing market. <gasps> oh my god. I don't want grape. I'll take chair. Uh, <gasps> okay, I guess I'll just take cherry. I think I just wasted two euros. Um, excuse me, what is this? Oh, is this a bulb thing? Is this a gardening tool? Oh, is that for bees? I wonder what this says in English. I was like, this, that's an interesting kind of pump. Comprehend. Okay, so I'm gonna be needing to translate a lot of things. She's got Google goggles, sis. She can translate. You hold up your smartphone, and Google goggles, sis, will translate this stuff for you on signs. 
We buy flowers. All right, that's good to know. I'll probably sell some flowers at some point. I have $168. Energy drinks? Uh, no, 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 I didn't mean to buy that. No, I can't go back. Girl, go. When she's drinking something, why does it sound like she's dying? Can I leave here? Thank you. My mistake, I just accidentally bought a whole bunch of not Nancy, stop. Can I translate this? Ah. Oh. Oh, that's probably someone's name. I was, uh, <laughs> me, I was about to be like, gotcha. You know what? I'll go ahead and buy it. I'll take it. I can't read this. Yes, I translated that already. Oh, put your book back. There you go. Okay. Okay, well, I bought this pump thing. I'm going to read my journal. Check. Check. Talk to her. I haven't done that. Wait for the police to page me. Then head up to the roof and start watching. Oh, well okay. Done. I remember that. Can't Pick check up. that off yet. You know what? So, I'm not going to do this real quick. I'm going to go back up to the house. She says I haven't done that with a lot more sass in this game. This is what the old lady was talking about becoming unrich. I know, I just can't stop spending money. Thank you so much for the bit, Sasha. I appreciate that. Keep those skiz, skiz, skiz going in the chat. She does drink like a six year old. I just have nothing to say to that man. So the police never paged me. Maybe they'll page me when I'm on the roof. Hello again. Do you always wear that locket? I've only had it a week. My boyfriend gave it to me just before I left. Not I Ned known. or Ted. That explains why it is so uh, <laughs> ordinary. <laughs> Which yeah. is not a bad thing. Fred's it pretty basic. That, uh, well, Zed? When one lives in Venezia, one becomes so used to true beauty that anything less tends to stand out like uh, dirt on a white rug. My roommate, Helena Berg, does she stay here alone? I'm going to call him a different name every time. time. I met her at a party which Rosetta del Bene gave. When Helena found out where I lived, she practically begged me to let her stay here. And with Rosetta standing right oh. there, well, I could not say no. Why was she so insistent Tell me the about being says. here? She said it was because the Nas Costa is so centrally located. Which it is. I'll truck it. Uh -huh. But I think it was because I am so centrally located. Oh. She is what you call a social climber. Always asking me about parties. When they are, where they are, who is invited, what should she wear, whose name should she say to get in. Que schifo. The upper class of Venezia is close schifo. to our status. Elena is full of volio, this is true, but she will never be one of them. Us. I'll stop pestering you now. Is Ciao. she gatekeeping being popular and rich? Because that's probably fair. <laughs> ah! I better go somewhere private and call some. Oh, I'll go to the room. Yeah, that's what I needed to do. She's literally gatekeeping being rich and popular. Which you basically have to be born into wealth these days. Society. Okay, let's call Sophia. I know that rooftop's gorgeous. Are they really gonna make me go dancing? Oh, should I call her on the real phone? How about I go out here and call her? They contacted me? Oh, that was that phone call? Dance in a cat suit or you're fired. Wait for the police to page me. 
Still have to do that. Well, they haven't paged me. I'm waiting on my beeper. I got the hairpin. I haven't done that. I can't pick the lock. I'll die. He killed me last time. I was paged? Why don't I see the page? Let's read the journal. I, I see you're just going to keep my eyes open. I have to remember to call Ned. It's blinking because you were paged. And why don't I have any messages? I don't know how pagers work, y'all. I'm sorry. I was literally born in 1988. There were no pagers. Pagers were done. I'm sorry that I had a cell phone. That's your phone and not your camera? I don't know. Alright. If y'all are just gonna sass me, I'm gonna read the guide on Game Boomers. If all I'm gonna get from the chat is sass, I'm gonna go to Game Boomers. Jeep <laughs> Pavarotti, thank you so much for the bits. I appreciate that so much. Keep those goose 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 going in the chat. The pager beats time to go to work. Go up to the balcony, stamp and use the binoculars on the window of the Argon building. Okay. I can do that. I can do that. <laughs> Gameboomers.com never gives me that. I'm just kidding. Oh, God. I'm too far away to see anything. All right. I understand the tea now. I just wanted to go dancing. Wow, they really said you're gonna get motion sick in this game, huh? Can I blow dart him? Nancy, what are you doing? <laughs> and then it goes, Shh, and he's got 5G. Bird watching, studying archers. Sp Spying on someone? Davvero? <laughs> Mind your own fucking business. How about that? She's telling, she's trying to tell me what to do when she not even spending her fucking money. Don't tell me what to do. This is my Italian adventure. Am I supposed to watch him as long as I'm supposed to watch him? I'm sorry. I didn't pay to watch this straight man. I didn't pay to come to Italy to watch this straight man. Is that it? Nancy, get a grip. Learn how to use the fucking binoculars, sis. Okay. You see the little, the, a little sniper dot appears on the back of his head. I'm just gonna check my Twitter, I guess. This looks interesting. He pulls the pigeon and he bites it. Oh, carrier pigeons. Why is he skipping? All right, that I definitely was a motion capture. He removed something from the pigeon's leg. You are positive? Yeah, yes, he bit that he pigeon's leg right off. He studied it, then left the office. Maybe he is using a trained pigeon to communicate with someone. Yes, this could be true, because we know that by phone he talks to almost no one. Here is what we will do. I will deliver to you a tracking device. You will sneak into Fango's office when he is not there and feed it to the pigeon. Feed it to the pigeon? to see in what direction it has flown. You want me to feed a tracking device to a pigeon? It will be very, very I'm sorry. Funny. I need to call, I like, to leave it at the, ATM. the animal, anim animal welfare. So we will leave it for you in the costume store in Campo Santa Maria Famosa. It will not the costume the store. There. You will have to find it. How will I know what it looks like? Very soon, I will send a picture of it to your PDA. But you must locate the device quickly. If you do not find it in time, it will destroy itself. If that happens, we will hide another device. Your PDA will show you where we have hidden it. 
You want me to feed a tracking device that self-destructs to a pigeon? The self-destruct mechanism will automatically deactivate when you pick it up. And do not worry. The device will not hurt the pigeon after it is swallowed. Well, then I guess I'm on my way to Campo Santa Maria Formosa. After you have fed the tracking device to the pigeon... I don't think this is how the FBI it. works. You must find out where the pigeon goes when it leaves Fongos. And you must discover what it is carrying. Call me Drugs. These things. Two oh. tablets of Molly. Honey, we came to Italy to get turned. Oh my god, that is a, is that a cyanide capsule? It's not. Not me, Nancy Drew, fully biting into my cyanide capsule. <laughs> Pigeon bug. Pigeon bug! Italian Gamer Joe, thank you so much for the bitch! When you get paid, that's because the agent spotted Fongo in his office. Oh, I see. The more you know, sis. You know? Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Okay. So, we have to pick up the pigeon bug. Don't make me dance. Don't make me sing. Is it in the fucking outfit? It's in the outfit, isn't it? And I have to do this stupid game. Okay. Hold your britches. Get the tracking advice. Open the PDA, see what it looks like. Save, it says save here. Immediately click using the tip of the cursor on the white pill. Oh, there is a pill. It self-destructs? Oh, shit. Where is it? Did it already self-destruct? Is this the wrong place? The white pill right of the box on the left side of the shelf at the back wall. The Costumi de Vera. Oh, so the catsuit is just something I get to wear. It's not really that fun. Do I need the catsuit to win the game? Isn't this the place where they said? Oh my god, that pill's gonna fucking blow up. Oh, I'm at the wrong place. Shit. I gotta fucking go. Compo. Oh, I need to go over here. Got it. Campo Santa Maria Formoso. I got that confused with Campo San Polo. Egg on my face. Pigeon egg on my face. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna save it. Got it. Wigs? Man? Are these... I didn't mean to buy that. I'm sorry, this clown costume though? No thank you. No one's working here? A mustache? I just bought those wedged ballet flats. I didn't mean to click that. I don't really have the money for that. This red wig, me going full on Black Widow, Marvel Black Widow in Venice? With that cat suit and this red wig? Sarah Paulson found dead, honey. Sn absolutely snatched. Alright, let's go to his office building. Which I think was here. I don't remember for sure. Oh yeah, this was it. Okay. So... Get it together, Nancy. This is not a key. This is what I need. I wonder if I need it, um... 
I don't know if, for sure if this is how I'm going to give it to the pigeon. Bye, Arizona girl. Glad you got to be here. All right. Yeah. Here she is. All right, hold your horses. I would think I would combine it with that. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Eat these turds. This is how we have to give Piggy his fucking pills at night. <laughs> Okay. Oh my god, I can pet the pigeon? Okay. Oh my gosh, Bongo's coming back! Get the fuck out, Nancy! Well, how did that give me any time to get out? Maybe I was supposed to hide. Maybe I was supposed to jump out the window. Just grab that pigeon. How did he get there so fast? Okay, we'll hide next time. Also, oh gosh, no back seating, back. please. Here we go. I am not a stranger to hiding in locker jail, a prison. <laughs> Fly with the pigeon. Me in this game jumping right out the window. I'm gonna punch him. Oh. Me with a knife, fully ready to murder him. Fully ready. Alright, the pigeons just flew away. Can I track some stuff now? I still don't really know what that does. Comedia del Arte! It's called Art, sis. Maybe we... There's some masks that are not checked off. Can I take a picture of this? I don't have a camera. Alright. Regale... Oh, this is the one the Phantom wears! I feel like that one was on the cover. <gasps> Binary code! I really don't have a fucking camera in this game. Alright. Can't translate that from Italian? No. <laughs> oh, you know what I never read? My sassy detective. Most people are locked doors and obstacle, pin and tumbler lock, got it when the tumbler. Detector Nectar? The ultimate think drink? This just tell me how to unlock a fucking door. I already know how to unlock a fucking door. I can waste my time. Oh, brochures. I need my Italian dictionary. That one says Bermuda, Nancy. Relax in Bermuda, Tahiti, Aruba, Jamaica. Ooh, I want to take ya to Bermuda, Bahama. Well, I'm assuming I need to go track the bird, but I just love fax machines. I just love fax machines. Mi, re, do. Oh my god, I watched the sound of music. Mi, re, do, si, la, re. Re, do, la, fi, sol, do. I saw sound of music and it's over for these clowns. I'm gay. Oh my gosh, a fish! Ooh, some swords. 
Um, all right, so we translate this. The University of Bologna. <laughs> Masters of Computer Science. That's a good degree, actually. He probably was able to get a job. Okay, so you know what? Good for him. Antonio Fongo. Digital data storage. Oh my god, why is this still relevant? Why are his degrees still relevant and none of mine are? Can I go to... Oh, no, no, no. I need to follow the bird, don't I? Do I need to follow the bird? Oh, interesting. So it says go left and down. Oh, interesting. So I'm assuming this is how GPS worked back in the day. Alright, this place has got to be covered in shit. One of these is the bird. Yeah, one of these is the bird. Now the bird was a pigeon. It was pigeon shaped. Wrong bird. Not that one. I have to chase this damn bird. <gasps> From the way you are dressed, you are a man. <laughs> Who are you? What? Uh, my name is Nancy Drew. It will explode soon club. enough. You cannot come in. Sorry. My name is Il my Isabella Parigi. House of Ga- Oh, that sounds fun. It's like an arcade. Knowing this Nancy Drew game is probably like a porn store. Like, my God. Okay, down into the... Okay, probably here. Knowing Nancy, it's like a hard porn, hardcore porn theater. She is having some Italian adventures. <laughs> I see you are an American. We, we, freaky. Now, how the holy fucking shit. Now... This is like literally four pixels by two pixels. Am I supposed to see a bird that has a turd tied to its leg? I don't know how I'm supposed to recognize this bird. Let's go to Game Boomers. Oh, they actually show which bird it is. I right, follow the pigeon. Look for the pigeon with yellow legs. So it's got yellow legs? I didn't even pick up on that clue, and I'm a Nancy Drew expert. They all have fucking yellow legs. I'm sorry, but why do all pigeons have yellow legs? That one. Oh, I should have found it at the other place. This shows me where it was in the other place. Yellow legs. Imagine they all have yellow legs. Yellow legs. Yellow legs. Yellow legs. Wrong bird. Oh, fuck a row. Fuck a row. Take the message. Oh my gosh, Ashley! Hey! 36 months! Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Thank you for the resub. Keep those goos 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 going in the chat. You are, of course, what me dreams are made of. What memes are made of, I almost said. Uh, Caddy Noir, Half Moon Summer. I didn't know it's timed. Thank you so much, Caddy Noir, for the bits. I appreciate that. And not poison the bird to get the right bird. Thank you so much. Keep those goos 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 going in the chat. It's okay. The bird, we'll get the bird. Oops, try again. Oops, try again. I mean, literally. Oops, try all again. These fucking birds. Oops, try again. Nope. Nancy Drew, you can shut the fuck up. All right. Now I need to go straight left, which is kind of over here. 
Me? Literally just following a flock of pigeons all over Italy on my vacation? Okay, it kind of had a green head. It kind of had a... This Wrong one. bird. Son of a bird. It had like a green head and yellow feet. Oops, try again. Wrong bird. Is she, what is she, what's the plan here? We're just gonna catch it out of the air? Nope. Come on, Nancy. Wrong. Green head, two straps, yellow legs. Green strap, green head, two straps, yellow leg. <laughs> green straps, two turds, yellow leg. Maybe I'll get the bird if I use my second gen Apple Pencil. If this game were on iPad, it'd be over for you clowns. Okay, now I know which one it is on this one. It's this one. Gotcha! She really just snatched that Hello? fucking bird out of the sky, didn't what she? What kind of message is that? Thank you so much, Kenny Noir. I appreciate it. Thank you for the bits. You mean I just chased down a fucking bird for a thing that says hello? Nancy, you have tracked the pigeon. After it left Bongos, it flew to Campo Santa Margarita. It landed right next to this place called Casa Fuck de these Giochi. Pigeons. Casa de Giochi. You are sure? Yeah. Is something wrong? Casa, Casa de Giochi? Oh, when I go to an Italian restaurant, I always get the Ginochi. The Ginochi? Perhaps Tatsa is working for him too. Look around the Casa de Giochi, Nancy. Talk to Tatsa if you can. Get on his good side. See how much you can find out without making him suspicious. Was the pigeon carrying a message? Yes. Yeah, it, it said hello. In English, followed by an exclamation point. There is a dot at the bottom of this exclamation point. Yeah? You must find a microscope and examine this dot, Nancy. If Fungo was sending a message to Tatsa, maybe it's hidden there. A microdot, of course. I'll do that. I'll find a microscope and take a look what at it. What is a microdot? I you. you will hear from me. They still won't let me in. I'm assuming I'm having to change clothes. That's fair, sis. Where am I? Oh, okay. Wonder if I'm gonna get to go to all these places. It looks like so much fun. I love having fun. <laughs> oh, Jesus! Well, I'm glad this is making your day a little better. I'm Another sorry you had a hard package? day, though. The press. Oh, it's me chocolates. Il dottore. Did I translate this? Nope. I would just like to eat the. What if I just? <gasps> I can't eat the fucking chocolates. Oh my god, I am so hungry. Nancy, come on. Dig the fuck in. What are you doing? Oh my god. <laughs> they won't let little 16 year old me into this club? It was not my idea for her to stay here. Believe you me. She's gossiping nice. about, me? about me? I shouldn't listen. No, you should listen. Me. No, me. In fact, I rather like her. But I'm going to anyway. <laughs> she spends most of her time on the roof bothering me. She is always up there looking through binoculars. Uh oh. She says she is a spy. Not me giving myself a away. Spying on someone. That that's what, what we do. Said. Come now, Margarita. She was giving your leg a good tug, that's all. This giving your leg a good friend. tug. I apologize for the trouble she makes. If she bothers you, you tell me and I will tell her. Oh, she's fine. I would burst she's the fuck in right now and I'd say, you Margarita, mind, you know you're rich you. but you ain't shit. Your time's a coming. Eat, hashtag eat the rich. Hey, Flops. 
I'm back. I heard everything. Hello, Nancy. I'm pissed, and I'm here for revenge. Um, not as this Assassin's Creed. Thank you so much, Caddy Noir. I was reading a review for... Okay, so you, someone tweeted at me that they wanted me to play this new game. What's it called? Superhero... DC Superheroes... Superhero Girls Teen Power. I was looking it up, and when the review said, This is just like Assassin's Creed, and I was like, Superhero... I oh. Sorry, I heard myself. I was like, I don't think this game is like Assassin's Creed. Anyway, thank you for the bits. I know you didn't want that story. James Blood, 99! Those chocolates are roaches? Maybe there's someone's trying to poison me. Thank you so much for the bits. And Dee Pavarotti, thank you so much for the bits too. You are, of course, what dreams Do are made of. you know who that box of chocolates Keep those in the cause, cause, cause going in the chat. No, I didn't really look at it because I assumed it was for you. It's not? No, it's for someone named Il Dottore. Why does he oh, move like an animatronic? I, was afraid, I mean, I assumed they were from that locket fellow of yours. His name is Il Dottore. Ted. I who that could be. His name is Fred. Thank you very much. Would it be okay if I used your microscope? I have a okay very strict I... policy when it comes to my equipment. No use one touches your it microscope with me. to look for and your now, brain. You. I trust you, Nancy. Please be my guest. Oh, thank you. Oh, let's put the turd on it. Wow, this really is... What the fuck? This is all in a dot? Il Dottore requests you to change the safe lock combination to 4355 sunk. Is that French, though? Sunk? 43556. Do I gotta remember that? Y'all remember that. I know his name. Oh my god. <laughs> yes, I know his name. Il Dottore regrets that you changed the safe. Four, three, five, five, six. Okay. Um, thanks, Flop. Thanks, Justin Timberlake. Call him Custin or Jolin? No, the all, all. Yeah, tell me the wrong combination. All right, who can I gossip so, to? I noticed someone got a box of chocolates. You perhaps? From a secret admirer? They're not for me. They're for someone named Il Dottore. I thought that was someone's special name for you. How disappointing. Especially since I was you going to You can fucking have all the chocolates, sis. I don't stop. care. Did what I made you decide this? to stay here this trip? I met Margarita at a party last October, and when she heard I was going to need a place to stay when I made this trip, she practically begged me to stay. Something's here. not adding up. Margarita said you Margarita like, to go to you like to go to parties. I'm sure she had a lot more to say about me than that. I think she's jealous of me. I'm young. I have a career, <laughs> lots of friends. I can pay my own way. Margarita had to marry a man with money in order to make Oh my god, himself. what is all this gossip? Do you have a Carnivale costume yet? No, but I have been invited to several parties, so I'm definitely going to get one. I've got this strange urge to dress up as a cat. Oh my god, me going to a Halloween party as a cat? I'll Just underwear and okay? cat ears. One, one. Just underwear and cat ears. Fully. Well, we know where the cat outfit is, obviously. So, I... This one's locked, isn't it? Am I allowed to lockpick this in front of everybody? Let's save it. Just to make sure. Oh, that's a key. Oh, this one moves a little differently. Does it? Yeah, it does. Shit. So that one can move on its own. It doesn't really matter where that one goes. Chicken cackle? Is this just supposed to be an Easter egg? Why did I just hear a chicken cackle? 
Why did that say chicken cackle? I'm over that door. Egg. <laughs> the chicken cackle? This gotta be an Easter egg, right? Her house really is falling apart. She needs to get it together. Oh, yeah. I ate all of those, huh? Um, let's look at my journal. My to-do list. Spam call! No, thank you. I wish you would let me hide the things that Check. are checked. Okay, so I did that. All done. Did that. All done. All done. All done. Check. Shoot, Can't I've done that so off much. Yet. Oh, I didn't check out his computer. Did that. I really should have looked at his computer. Huh? Check. It's the PDA. There Can't must be a reason. A music box. Find out the music box. I haven't done that. Oh, yeah. So we got to find out a way to get All in done. there. With the microscope. Still have to do that. Tell Sophia that a box of chocolates. So we need to tell Sophia about the chocolates. Can't check that off yet. Okay, so the combination. Here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna go make this woman's life a living hell. Hello, Nancy. Who is, Who il, is dottore? il Dottore? Il Dottore means doctor. Uh, what doctor are you talking about? There's a box of chocolates downstairs for Il Dottore. Someone must have All left done. here by mistake. <laughs> Has anything else for Il Dottore ever been delivered here? I am up here all day. Something gets delivered, something does not get delivered. I do not know. I do not care. She's gonna be one big melanoma, sis. Will you be dressing up in a costume for Carnival? An ST. Ultra okay. I have fallen in love with Commedia dell'arte. So this year I will dress up as my favorite character, the big nosed nasty Pulcinella. He and I are so opposite. No one will ever guess it is me. Sure. I'll talk to you later. She Ciao. thinks she isn't nasty. Okay, hold on. Don't ask me what. I, oh, is he still gone? Maybe. Can I spy on other people? That would be fun. You just see people going at it, sis. Would it be all right if I pick some flowers? Oh yeah, I can sell Prudence. them. Prudence got them from a plantation in Hawaii, the Healy Healy Research Center. That's got to be a throwback like to another meat. game, right? I hate margarita. <laughs> Oh, I have the bee puffer. I thought I was shooting them with a rifle. I thought I was shooting the bees with a rifle. <laughs> All right, just going to pick these flowers. Just stand over there to the left, Margarita. <laughs> Hashtag save the bees. Sniping bees. No, it was just smoke. That's what you're supposed to do. It just puts them to sleep. That's how you, like... Help them in the beehives. Y'all, don't worry. That wasn't killing bees. Y'all really gonna make me feel bad even if I did kill the bees in a Nancy Drew game? That's just smoke. People do that Hello? all the time. Nancy, I do not hear from you. Have you examined the micro dot the pigeon was carrying? <laughs> no. Yes, I have. Good. Sorry, I should have called. Anyway, the message, which was written in English, said... I thought she told me not to call her. ...requests you to change the safe room lock combination... To four three five five six. Il dottore? Yes, which is really interesting. I'm gonna eat some raisins. In his office, Fongo has Don't a poster me. of Commedia dell'arte masks. He's crossed out all but five of the masks, and among the ones that aren't crossed out are the Brigella mask, the mask the Phantom wears, right, and the mask for Il dottore wasn't crossed out either, and Drama. it was in the middle, like it was more important than the others. And when I went back to the place where I'm staying, a box Raisin? of chocolates had just been delivered for someone named Il Dottore. They're on to me. It's very possible that Il Dottore is one of the people at the Canos Costa. Perhaps Fango and the Phantom and whoever else they are working with are going by the names of Commedia dell'arte characters. This would well, that's fucking Margarita. With each other. And is that true? Perhaps those chocolates are a message of some kind. And this Il Dottore was at the center of that poster you saw. 
Perhaps the person the message was meant for is the ringleader. Just what I was thinking. Here is what we will do. I will have a technician hide tracking devices and objects these people... Not the tracking devices again, Sophia. When we know which of them is Il Dottore, we will activate the appropriate device and be able to follow him. Awesome. Let's see. Helena's always writing, so for her, I could plant a bug in her pen, maybe. Not and this, Nancy. sunning herself, so you could hide a bug for her in a sunglasses case. Colin? But for Colin... We'll have to stick Colin, it right you up bug his a butthole. Tile. You know, oh. the tessera... He's likely to carry a mosaic tile on his person. If it's from me, he will. <laughs> Long story. As as for this Colin, I will have I'll have to stick his. I'll have to insert his myself. Them. Then leave them for you in the Banca del Oro ATM. You should give them to each person as soon as you get them. Will do. Keep your fingers crossed. My fingers are always crossed. Pop off, Sophia. Can I really not eat the chocolate? <laughs> craisins are good too, but they're full of sugar. They usually add sugar to craisins because cranberries aren't sweet. So I gotta go back to the bank. Which, I don't know. It was down there. All done. I haven't done that. Catch that pigeon over the check that Use my off card yet. at the ATM. Pick up the bugs. Let's pick up the bugs. Okay, so I know where I am. I know where I am. I know where I'm going. And I know what this is. I know who you are. I know where this is going. And I know what I'm doing. I would love there to be a tracking device in the chocolate. That would be wonderful. Eat it right up, sis. I'd slop that down. They want to track me, sis. I got my cell phone on me. Who cares? I've got a pickup. Are these already bugged? Why am I holding a Fabergé egg? Did I miss something? Why am I holding a Fabergé egg? I'm gonna go sell those flowers. <laughs> Not the Fabergé egg! Oh, did I get that from the door? Oh, it's a literal Easter egg that I got from that door. That chicken shit an egg through the door lock? I'm sorry. I'm not here for it. I don't know what this is. I haven't been here yet. Why did I go here? No, this is not what I want. Did I just take a, the ferry? I have to take the ferry there? You know what? I'll go the long way. I'll walk across the river. Thank you very much. Oh, that works too. Oh, a gondola, excuse me. I know, I don't want a boat ride yet. It's just expensive. I'm not made of money. I'm not made of money. Grazie. I'm not made of money. I'm not. All right, do y'all want to do y'all want a fucking boat ride? We can do a fucking boat ride, but I'm doing the cheapest one. I did Luigi. Y'all made it sound like that was gonna be something. Luigi's free boat, and it's just, it's the fucking, it's the fucking broken door from the Titanic that Rose was on. Fucking <laughs> Luigi's paddling with his hands. If you pay, then they'll sing. All right.
I will do one dollar. Not this song. Not clouds. Not clouds instead of the city. <laughs> the more expensive, the better they sing. I kind of assume that. No, no, no. Just Luigi's fine. So blue is going through the canals. Okay, I see that now. The fucking clouds. They really said... What do you want to see, Nancy? Clouds? You want to see the city? Or you just want to look up at the clouds? Now, are these already bugged? I really should make sure. I haven't done that. Still have to do that. Okay, so they're already bugged. Plant them on the people. I can do that. I'll pay him not to do that. Yeah, but Nito was doing his best. Honestly, can y'all sing while driving a boat? Paddling a boat? Didn't think so. Just really sad, the judgmental vibe. Just really sad, is what I would call it. Hello, Nancy. I came across this turd. I came across this tessera and thought you might like it. It's quite beautiful. All the more because it came from you. Oh, gross. Thank you, Nancy. I I'm locking my it. door tonight, Colin. Okay, I'll be locking my door tonight. What are you going to be for Carnivale this year? Working, that's what I'm going to be. I haven't been invited to any festivities, which is just as well because I detest costumes. Colin so hates Carnivale, fun. I say, bah humbug. He's from the UK, isn't he? I should be running along. Did he say he was Drop from England? Again. Oh, let's plant this pin. Stealing your pin, placing a single turd within it. Let's translate this, actually. Sunny, sunny June! Oh my gosh. Weirdest American I've ever met. Glasses forever halfway down nose due to thick heavy lenses. Spiked unnaturally colored hair. Green and pink that day. Compulsive doodler. Very observant. Smart. International Space Station. Had every job on this earth. Was on his way to the Caribbean. Hartmut Krollmeister, wealthy, yet insists on wearing ill-fitting pink jerseys and hosting waste of time poetry slams. Poetry. Always invited to best parties, plays the token German intellect, adores fascination with Schiller and monkeys. Story ideas. Oh, and interesting people. Okay, well, let's put that down so I can click that and then click it again. Wrong book. Come on. There we go. Get it together. Global warming versus Venice. No one's ever written about that. Agenda of typical tourists in Venice. How many Venetians know how to swim? When Venetians leave Venice, where do they go? The impact of visions. Vis Ven <laughs> pigeons on Venice. Visions. Il Fantasma? Where do Venetian blinds really come from? Not the Venetian blinds storyline. I've heard you can meet Sunny June in one of the other games. I'm excited to. I'm really excited. I need to play that one. Thank you so much, Kit Kat Moss, for the bits. I appreciate that. Not Caddy Noir. Time to pick flowers Arkansas style. <laughs> but the, those poor bees. Thank you so much, Caddy Mark. If you die in the river, you have my gondolences. Hello, Nancy. Delete it. Thank you so I much. Keep those skis 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 going in the chat. Keep your sunglasses in. You are giving me a gift. You do not have to do this, Nancy. But I, I like gifts. We know you like free this handouts. One. You're rich. It is very nice. Grazie. I'll let you get back to your sunbathing. Yes, good, we know. Good. You're rich. Hello, Nancy. Oh. <laughs> I'll stop pestering you now. Hello, good, Nancy. Good. Hello, Nancy.
We love that. Shattered Medallion? Um, I've heard of that one. That's the one with Sunny June? Did that. Okay, I need to go back to his office and clearly look at his computer and then finally dress for success, I guess. At that fucking, to get into that one fucking place. She will burn soon. I hope, I think, I hope you mean in hell. So I need to go back to his office. I don't remember if it was here or here. It might have been the other place, but we'll check. Yeah, okay. This was the dancing place. The other place was where his office was. Is she walking? She must be walking. I hear little clip clops. All right, we'll save it before we go in his door, because who the fuck knows? Maybe I should have looked on the roof or something. He's probably in here waiting to kill me. And you know what? Pop off, sis. I just need to do him in order. I need to not do that. No, I did this so well the first time. Hold on. Does it change every fucking time? It does, I think. Because that was different. Maybe if I do it backwards this time. Oh, garbage. Oh, okay, I can do this. This one moves on its own. Beautiful! Beautiful! All right. Let's get on this computer. Beep, boop, beep, boop. Oh, you kidding me? Oh! What was the password? Y'all have one job. Oh, figure out the computer password. See if the combination of four somethings. Not boobies. Get out of here. Y'all are all canceled. Four, three, five, five, six. I think that was to a safe, though, wasn't it? Yeah, that's not going to be his computer password. See if the combination I found. I haven't done that. Open. So I'll look for a safe. The music box. Let's do some snooping. She's not very good at, like, looking at stuff, is she? Oh. Can I open any of the others, or was this just the one I was supposed to open? Looks like some cards are missing. Are this... This is tarot cards? Not tarot cards. Did she take them? No. Wonder if this has to do with the password. Try PB or Taffy. Maybe it's hidden. Oh, are these Mahjong tiles? What? I thought this was like... Yeah, no, these are tarot, right? Two of chalices, two of swords, pentacles, and, I don't know, sticks. What about the ace of base? Hmm? The ace of base. Oh, there's this old computer. Let's just take that. Out. I don't see a um. Oh. Oh, this is like an Easter egg. These like crinkle bars are everywhere, aren't they? Is that a marijuana cigarette? A marijuana cigarette? Oh my goodness. 420 blazing it. I have a feeling this is his password. 
Or this is a, I mean, this is binary code, right? But I don't have anything to translate that. So. We'll just skadoodle for now. Maybe I'll just go dancing. Now is the time to call 911 for sure. Hack the computer Arkansas style. Fully pulling out a shotgun. Thank you so much, Caddy Noir. I appreciate that. Keep those goos 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 going in the chat. Don't make me dance. Ugh. I need I fully need a shot of whiskey. For this fucking dance game. Hold on. What does Game Boomers have to say about this dance? You earn- Oh, you can earn money later by dancing for tips! Each dance has a sound and color cue. For the sound, press the sound icon to hear a sample of the cue. Click on the cat suit. Bell claps. I don't even know what an ocarina sounds like. The audition is successfully done when the bar reaches the right. Oh, the color cues are seen in various areas of the stage. Light bulbs. And the lights on the base of the stage. Good luck, happy dancing. Okay. You know what? I'll try to dance. Not I hope you dance. And I the one, hope you and the two. dance. Oh, clapping. Good. Oh, fuck y'all. I'm turning it out. Is that supposed to be something else? What is this move, Nancy? Bravissima! Oh my god! Wonderful! I have... Is that the buzzer? Oh, is that You're the buzzer? Awful. Fuck okay. you! Nice! Great job! Still some rough edges though, so take, take the custom home and practice! practice. Well, not what's, what's your, your name? name? Uh, Nancy? <laughs> Nancy? My name is Fred. Get it, from now on your name's, uh, Punchy. Punchy LaRue. But Not giving next? me my exotic dancer name. He literally typed that into one of those, like, what's your blah blah name generators? So I just got. Okay. I can't dance without my costume. Let's just say. I'm gonna go put. I'm gonna go. <laughs> Not bringing back Bulletproof by LaRue. <laughs> I did it! And I don't know how. That was pretty awful. Kit Moss, thank you so much for the bit. And Sunlandic Mindy, thank you for the bits. Dancing for tips. <laughs> thank y'all so much. Keep those goos 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 going in the chat. Well. See if the combination opens it. So I need to clearly dress a certain way to get into... Nochi. All done. I haven't done that. Now the music box is interesting. Me fully hip hop dancing to the music box. All right, here's what we're going to go do. I'm going to go change my outfit. I'm going to change my outfit, change my life. Strut in there with the cat. Maybe I will wear the cat suit. Should I wear the... I didn't even 
didn't do anything and I died. I was just trying to move my body through life. Am I supposed to catch it? Oh. I can't move. Why can't I move? My insurance rates doubled. I can't move. Oh, there we go. Am I supposed to swim? Should I try jumping in the water? Well, I guess I'm stuck in this god-awful time loop of this fucking vase falling on my damn head. Am I supposed to look up too fast? I can't click anything. These raisins are really good. I love raisins. Ah, it's like eating a raisin, but it's smaller. Oh, look up and back away. Got it. <laughs> and then I just leave the country. Nancy, get your ass back there. We aren't done. I tried to look down at it. She apparently doesn't care. Not the microwave cart tater tots. Did you try to kill so, me? What's going on? I'll come back later, okay? Come back anytime. Hello, Nancy. Did you try to kill me? I need to get going. Come back anytime. Wait, why did I come home? I'm going to make some phone calls. Oh, I was going to change my outfit. I was going to change my outfit, change my life. Got it. All right. Is this better? Is this part of the cat suit? What screams pair? Oh, the cat ears. Yes, 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 yes. Ah, the cat mask. Yes, 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 yes. My cat capris and my cat boots. Look at these that I bought though. Are those not sickening? Oh, we gotta take off the belt, right? Ah, yes, and put on the gloves. Oh my god. Nancy did not have to turn it out this hard. Now let's put on some acrylic paint. And I'm ready for a night out. There's a bathroom? Hi, I'm Connie. What the fuck just happened? Fight the shower. Hi, I'm Connie. <laughs> Did she name her turd Connie? I don't know what just happened. I didn't even know there was a bathroom. Alright, sorry flops, I gotta go. I think I'm not supposed to wear this outfit to this place, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Yeah, Connie from Waverly Academy. All right, flops. I'm dressed for the occasion this time. Carnivali. What? In this outfit? They told me to leave? I need a wig. Where was that wig store? Excuse me, where's the wig store? I think we got it. Hold on. Wig store. Was it here? Oh no, this is my bank.
You know what? I'm making y'all do Benito again. Spiritantus and ah, a day in Venice with raisins and my best Benito. Ah, oh. sing it to me, Benito. Me on this fucking gondola, sis. Can pay fucking alligator? No profumo così fino, in te core se ne va. Sing that one song. Do you know? Do you know Lady Marmalade? Do you know Womanizer by Benny Spears? Basta tierra del amore. Do you know Diamonds Are a Girl's Best Friend by Nicole Kidman in the hit movie Moulin Rouge? <laughs> Lady Marmalade. How long does this last? Like? <laughs> Do I get paid for listening to Benito? <laughs> Benito should pay me. <laughs> oh, that's French, isn't it? Do you know Lady Marmalade? <laughs> I don't even know where I was going or why I was going there now. Here we it is. What the fuck do they want me to wear? Hold on. I'm gonna look at Game Boomers. There's a warehouse? Oh, I did. It said you don't even have to do the dancing yet. Don't tell me! No back seating! Or are we just picking out a costume for fun? I've never seen Phantom of the Opera. I don't really know what it is. <laughs> um, thank you so much, Caddy Noir. Do you know New Queen Bee? This is our Pride Month celebration. Keep those goos 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 going in the chat. I appreciate that. Yeah, no back seating. I don't want to know what to wear. I want to figure this out. Listen, if y'all had my chat leaning over your shoulder the first time you played a Nancy Drew game, you probably wouldn't play the second one. I'll just say that. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, place the tracking vice advices. The chess book. Go to camp somewhere in a costume. How are you supposed to know that's what you're supposed to buy? This can open at any time. Go back to your bedroom, persevere, ignore this one. Yeah, y'all don't tell me what to wear. Only game boomers can help. Literally, that's why I want to figure it out by myself with game boomers. <laughs> Thank you so much, Kit Kat Moss. I appreciate that. Not uh, AP fashion. Hold on. What I really want to know is... Go to the kiosk at Piazza San Marco. Well, I want to go there first. Wait. Shit's expensive here. Nancy really dressing at the costume shop? Or... Piazza San Marco. Okay. I want to know things, but I want to know why. There's sunglasses I can buy here?
I really wish things would just be kind of highlighted. Does Hayden Panettiere know that she is qu quite literally in a Nancy Drew game? Maybe these books haven't shown up yet. Oh, there's this. I feel like my inventory is going to be full. Oh, the computer password might lead me to the next one. So I should focus on the computer password. Hayden? Oh, I thought she meant like she was in three Nancy Drew games. Oh, I can translate this. This is what we in the German industry call German. By Helena, but this is one of Helena's books. Helena Berg. Her fellow for a buckling in the way of testimony. Luigi, he was my uh, gondola, gondolani, gondoloni. Here to be an expert discerning. Oh, this is a lot of words. He was my gondoloni. I don't know what all of that said. Oh, hi! Luxury applies. Thank you so much for the raid. I appreciate that. Welcome, raiders. We're just solving a mystery in Venice. We're solving, um, slowly solving a mystery in Venice. Wait, where am I? Okay. Very slowly. Oh, we're just going to use Luigi this time. Dance for the Raiders. If you're new here, I stream every day, two to four usually. Um, Monday through Friday, Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday. A scandalous mystery. Solve that. Yeah, we do mysteries on Mystery Mondays. That's true. Casey, thank you so much for the bits. Mystery Monday. Keep those goos 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 going in the chat. Thank you, Caddy Noir. A scandalous Nancy. I suppose you could say that. We do love to wear this cat suit around town. Every four days a week, all week, we're here. Can I go bother what's her name? Hello, Nancy. I'll talk to you later. <laughs> Bella Roba. Hello, Nancy. No, 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 no. I'll talk to you later. Bella the, Roba. The disdain in her voice when she even looks at me. Can I continually sell flowers? Not this again. Can I just continually sell flowers and just continue to make lots of money? Oh god, the bees are mad! The bees get Ow. mad! Oh! The bees sting you! Oh my god, I need more powerful smoke. Oh my god, I got stung by a bee. I've never been stung by a bee in real life. I might be allergic. I'm, we might be allergic. She fully deserved that. It's just smoke. It just calms the bees down. Okay? As you can see, when they were trying to sting me, they were very calm. <laughs> they were very calm. Okay? Hey, I need to make a phone call. You know what? The Italian FBI kind of sucks at getting a hold of me. They're not the best at getting a hold of me. Guessing <laughs> bees. Very 1967. Hashtag save the bees now. We're not about this now. Don't I have their numbers? I am police. Oh, here we go. Phone numbers. Prudence Rutherford. Let's call Ned. You know what? This is kind of the last thing I would probably want to do in my life. Call my boyfriend Ned who gave me this ugly locket. But I'm going to call Ned. I guess this is dialing. Oh. Dialing out of the country. I hope Margarita doesn't mind me literally using up, spending thousands of dollars on this call out of the country. If Ned doesn't pick up, we're done, by the way. Hello? Hi, Ned. Or should I say, buongiorno? You shouldn't. Hey, Ned. I was hoping you'd call. 
I'm going to be that that partner. Where are you? Where are you? <laughs> Staying at Frank and Joe's, just like you arranged. Staying at Frank funny. the Hardy Boys? My research is going great. It's just that, well, in order to I get leave over the to country the and library, I've been Ned, to take the bus. Fred goes off what and has a threesome with the Hardy Boys? Joe happened to my car. Oh, no. He's been tinkering with it. If by tinkering you mean disassembling the engine and possibly the transmission and strewing the parts all over that closet in the basement he calls his workshop, yes, he's been tinkering with it. Ned, I told you. I said whatever you do, don't let Joe do any tinkering. I, I didn't know that's what you meant. He said he knew exactly how to fix that funny noise my car's been making, so I said great. I thought he knew what he was doing. He does know what he's doing. It's just going to take him like half a century to do it. But hey, you're taking mass transit. That's good. Yeah, I know. No tinkering. Fine. And I'm sure my car will be fine too. So how's it going there? If you there? took your engine apart, I think that's a really big problem if I'm being honest. Devin DeLima, it's great to see you. Thank you so much for the gift subs. Oh my gosh, the five gift subs. You are, of course, what dreams are made of. Keep those skus, skus, skus going in the chat. I appreciate that so much. And Kat, you know what? Thank you for the bits. Ned got his engine disassembled. Sis, they're, they're going to have to rebuild them from the ground up once Joe's done with them, apparently. Thanks again for the locket. Should I... Sh I don't even like the locket. Hey, before I forget, thanks again for the locket. I haven't taken it off since you put it on me there at the airport. Good. That was kind of the idea. I just wanted you to have a little reminder of home. Well, more specifically... I don't me. need any reminders, I Ned. I don't need any reminders, Ned, but thank you. It really is beautiful. Even the guy I sat next to on the plane over here who played solitaire the whole way liked it. It passed the semi-neurotic but otherwise thoroughly impartial geek test? Yes. Uh, playing solitaire? Just geek things. <laughs> Oh, you played solitaire on the plane? Geek. Geeking out with my solitaire flops. Pulling down my airline tray. Spreading out those cards. Turning them over. It does sound very controlling. Geek. Just geeky things. Playing solitaire on the plane. Uh, the plus, though, has some beautiful... I'm sharing a room with her, which makes me kind of nervous. I do need some advice. Let's not talk about Colin. I need some I advice. I need some advice. About what? How should I break up with my boyfriend? <laughs> I need help when it comes to figuring <laughs> out what the password to Fongo's computer is. The mask with the mustache. Find out its name and you'll be logged in in no time. Oh, the, max the mask with the mustache. Great. Thanks. My pleasure. Ciao. How does he know what my case is? Fucking Ned having a three-way with the Hardy Boys? What is this loaf of fucking bread? Thought you might enjoy these. They are from a shop in the Jindecha. Is this just a bucket of meat? He knows me so well, sis. Oh. Hmm. Interesting flavor. Nancy just ate raw meat. Nancy fully sucking down this raw sausage. <laughs> Nancy said, Ugh, "My boyfriend with the so good." Nancy, are you all right? Oh my gosh, you're positively green, Nancy. Ugh. Is this the third time I've died? Oh, I should so not have eaten those sausages. I'm sorry, we need Nancy, to talk about this. I've been worried about you. How are you feeling? A little fucking angry, A little Colin. Angry, actually. Those sausages you left in my room gave me food poisoning. What? Immediate what food sausages? poisoning. I didn't leave sausages in your <gasps> room. The note they came with said they were from you. Well, someone else must have written it and signed my name because I promise you, I did not leave any sausages or any note in your room. Besides, you don't think someone would give you tainted sausages on purpose, do you? They might have. I'm they very rich. Have. Why would I'm very try rich. To you? You're right. It was probably just an accident. Of course it was. 
Nancy, I've kept you long enough. Heard about Ted and Fred having a threesome with the Hardy Boys, and she just had to suck down that sausage, sis. Ooh, great mask! I like it. Oh, I'm wearing you the thing. look better than the last time I saw you. What happened? Oh, I made the mistake of eating the sausages at someone. I just like to me. put on my cat Apparently outfit and eat raw sausages. Looked. That's terrible. Who would have left sausages for you? The note that was with them She's said they were such an expressive Colin. face. God, Colin. I love Sarah Paulson. You'd think someone who can see a flaw in a tiny little tile from three meters away would be able to pick out decent sausages. He says it wasn't him. He says someone else wrote that note and left the sausages for me. Why would someone do that? He probably just doesn't want to... What do they always say in the movies? Sucking down that toys. sausage, sis. Anyway, the good news is, whatever was in those sausages didn't do you any permanent harm. You're back to your cute, spunky teenage self. Ah, the moisturizer's working, my cute, spunky teenage self. I read that article you wrote. I read the article you wrote in Eurovelt magazine. Would you like a raisin? The Leo Macchiano trial? That was one of six articles I wrote about the trial. What? I could have written six more. It was so fascinating. What made it so fascinating? Oh, exclamation mark lotion. Run, the more <laughs> testimony I heard regarding its inner workings, the more impressed with it I became. Every heist was so well planned, and the role of everyone in his organization oh, was she so did well it. delineated that Macchiano was the only one who knew who everyone was and what everyone did. How did the police finally catch she him? She did it. One of his underlings cheated one of his underlings, who decided to get even by going to the police. Still, it took some two years to I'm collect invested. enough evidence to bring Macchiano to trial. And even though he was My microphone's not even picking up the eating sounds, is it? And oh, for the sausage? Yeah, the in the sausage. meantime, it looks like the void he left behind is being filled by this phantom thief guy. Indeed. Macchiano always eliminated his competition one by the other. So this phantom, he is... How do you Americans Endowed. Put it? He's making hay while the sun oh. shines. Ganz genau. I thought she was going to say he's endowed. Does Leo Macchiano have a family? Is it possible that the Phantom is, or used to be, part of Macchiano's wrong <laughs> ring? No. Odd. The Phantom is obviously an expert at what he does. He would have been very high up in the organization, in which case he would have been arrested along with everyone else. So and not that related to that case. He'd be stealing art. He'd be stealing food from the prison kitchen. What can you tell me about Enrico Tazza? Well, he was rumored to have been in charge of safeguarding the goods Leo Macchiano's gang stole. Now that Macchiano's in jail, he's back to Why just being the about this local case? card parlor. There must Why be a link. Ask? I saw his name somewhere. All I remember is he sounded a little shady. As I say, old habits die hard. Tatsa could still be doing something illegal, but if he is, it would be small potatoes compared to what he was doing for Macchiano. Small potatoes. We Macchiano bought some at the farmer's market last weekend. He oh, they were so good. Secrets. Not that that makes him any less of a criminal. Nancy's How very invested in this. Two teenagers and one toddler. If you're thinking that perhaps one of them is upholding the family tradition in the persona of Il Fantasma, that's extremely unlikely. Nancy's really later, into okay? genealogy. Have fun. Our real goal being in Italy, Nancy's tracking down her roots. <gasps> I can finally read her shit. Thought you might. Did she feed me the slop? Oh my god, did Margarita try to poison me? Thank you for inviting me to your party last week. What a grand event. It was an honor to have been seated next to Coconut Vers... Oh, Count Versberger. Although his breath was quite fragrant, it took some getting used to. I'm sure you were unaware of his unfortunate problem when you made this... Oh my god, what is this gossip? I look forward to seeing you at the reception for the Fredonian Ambassador. Did she fucking poison me? I'm gonna fucking poison her. Me putting full-on bee pesticide in her drink. Fully putting bee pesticide inside of her drink. Let's just take a look and see. Okay, still can't look at him. He's done. Should I call Sophia and tell her someone tried to kill my turn? 
drink in her glass. <laughs> no, she finally disintegrated under the sun. Where did everyone just fucking go? Um, he left some turd-shaped mosaics. Religious relics, probably. That looks like his handwriting, sis. The handwriting on this envelope is the same as the handwriting on the note that came with the sausages, which means Colin sent them. Yeah, it did say his name, didn't it? Private viewing of the sh Oh! Yeah, we're matching things now. Private viewing of the sh chalice. <gasps> January 18th! The sunroom coming at 4 p.m. No thank you to all of these words. Now this looks like a puzzle, but I can't move the pieces. Unless I can, and I'm not moving them correctly. It doesn't appear that I can move any of these pieces. If I had some scotch tape, I could get this done real quick. If I just, you could just hand me my scotch tape. Now she's still here. Colin's creepy as hell is what's happening. So let's go get the password now that I know the situation there. So I'm here. Is it here? Yeah. I have no idea if he's in here. I'm going to save the game. I'm assuming he's not at this point ever in here. Oh, maybe I should have gone the other direction. This might work out. JK. So this one moves on its own. We don't really have to worry about that one too much. Okay, okay. Yeah, we're good. So the mask that had what on it now? The one with the mustache. Il Capitano. Il Capitano. That's going to be the password? Il. <gasps> oh my god. What? Airline cancel. First of all, y'all know that I have a chess trophy. I played chess in middle school and junior high, and I got a trophy from winning. I just want y'all to- I just want y'all to remember that, so when we play chess, it's fucking over. The following airline reservation has been cancelled! He was gonna go to- <gasps> To Venice! Oh, Tahiti! Chess log. How about I not- Garamuchia. Oh my god. Now that's a political. Wonderful. Please find your mailing address for Billings. What chess notation do you refer? Krollmeister. I understand, but I prefer algebraic. Whenever you want to quit, close the phone. I'll start. So there's like their whole chess game. Meet me outside the newspaper kiosk at San Marco tomorrow. And then he canceled going to Aruba. Then my friend Bigella will be playing. He's mentioning there. Please change my account though, as you wit. Charge my account. I found a similar game once in a trash can outside your office. What? Next to the fountain in the Campos del Polo. Why do I care about anything that's on this computer? <gasps> A knife. Not does this computer have barnacle blast. It would be fucking game over for this. For everybody if it had barnacle blast. 
I would think it would be time to trash dive. Let's go look in some trash. Uh, where? I like being loud. Where? They said there was a trash can outside his office. Hmm. Oh, yeah, I gotta sell the flowers. Yeah, that's right. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I eat my raisins. Oh, that's a trash. That's a trash. Oh, that's a trash, too. I haven't done that. Still have to do that. Can't check that off yet. Check. I did do that. Reason for the music box, binoculars, prudence. Well, we might kind of be at a... Oh, there's the fountain. Oh, I hate it here. <laughs> Nancy loves just going to different countries and going through the trash cans. That's not what y'all do. I think we're at a good stopping point. I've been streaming for about three hours. Ooh. Well, we've been playing for about two and a half. I'd say I talked for the first 30 minutes. Hold on. Let's go ahead and save the game. I do not want to lose this situation. Where we are at right now after that pot fell on my head four to five times. <laughs> I'm enjoying this game. You know what? When she start, when she got up on that stage, put on that cat suit, and started dancing, and now I'm wearing that cat suit around all of Italy, I re this game really hooked me. That's the moment the game really sunk its claws into me. Ned phones Nancy to ask for a Jopin relationship. All these, that's so true, Kit Kat Moss. They are all creeps in this game. Oh my god, not the locket is bugged. KNR and Kit Kat Moss, thank you so much for the <laughs> bits. I appreciate that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we're going to be doing Resident Evil tomorrow. Let's get that outro music started, okay? Ah, Y'all stick around for tomorrow. You're going to want an exclamation point bestie. Get your bestie bag. <laughs> ah! Thank y'all so much for being here. I love y'all so much. Tomorrow, Resident Evil Village, hopefully. Um, this is my favorite Nancy Drew game so far, I gotta say. Thank you for all the bits, donations, subs, and gift subs. I appreciate it so much. Wonderful Patreon patrons. Y'all are all freaking amazing. I love y'all so much. Be safe. Be well. I will see y'all tomorrow. Bye, guys. Bye. And you can't continue clapping. <laughs>